Can you sprout an arm? I don't know. Dad. He sees hum. Honey bag, hummies. Oh dear. Whoa, here's one. Run. <laughs> hey, Southwest Airlines, I'm here. Hi, yeah, my flight was just canceled. Can you walk? From Denver to New York. Can you rebook my flight? I don't know! I need a new flight. Okay! They are flying on Southwest Airlines. Well, over 2,000 Southwest flights canceled today. Am I all set? <laughs> my hot dog! Is this optimal acceleration? No! Oh, come on, guys! This is Hammy. He's always the life of the party until there's an actual party. You see, Hammy likes to eat. And since he invites himself to every snack he sees, he's had to spend a lot of time behind his doggy gate whenever the humans host their families and friends. Easter, 4th of July, Christmas, and countless other events were never kind to Hammy. So he had a thought. If he could make a charcuterie board that both humans and floofs could enjoy, Hammy could spend more time being the life of the party rather than being a doggy gate stowaway. So the little chef got cooking. A lot. So much so that his tiny paws wrote a cookbook that he slyly titled Barcuterie, his mission to ensure that none of his floofy friends will ever be denied a tasty morsel again. Heroes come in all shapes and sizes, and Hammy definitely isn't one of them. He's just a hungry little hippo that likes to party. What's that, Liv? Ha! Boy! For what? Good luck! <laughs> Simon! Battle set! His vitals are slipping. He's flatlining. Oh dear. Ah! <laughs> Jenna Ortega's dating Pete Davidson? No way! Let that sink in. Okay! Oh. Oh, no, no, no. It's just a gift exchange! You said elephant! <laughs> Where'd it come from? Africa! This takes the trail out of my wine glasses. Oscar, hold down! Happy birthday, Liv! Language! Make a wish, Olivia! That's six! That's a G She is. It's not your dick! Run. Turn right. Right. The other right. You can eat corgi butts. <gasps> we wanted to toast our new marshmallows, but our family doesn't have the best track record when it comes to fire. So this time, we hired Hammy as our fire safety inspector to make sure the house doesn't burn down while making corgi butt s'mores. And since s'mores need a fire, we built ourselves a fire pit because, well, we have time on our hands. It was a pretty easy assembly, but took longer than expected since Hammy and Olivia didn't feel like lending a paw to help. After a quick fire safety course from Inspector Ham, we felt comfortable enough turning on the gas and revving up our new balcony fire pit. We finally got around to lighting some momos on fire, but as good as these fire pit treats tasted, Olivia still felt violated by the whole thing. Open the door! Who is it? Leave it on the doorstep and get the hell out of here. Uh, I'm gonna give you to the count of ten uh, to get your ugly, yellow, no good keister off my property. What's a keister? One, two, ten. Uh, Fuck this! Earthquake! This isn't dramatic. But no, still my week! Your birthday was two days ago. That was new! Make a wish, Ham. Ponies? After you blow out the candle. Putting the cart before the pony. <laughs>